What's going on, everybody? Good morning, good people. This is Pastor Paul, your pastor and encourager. I'm out here walking uh, my wife's dog <laughs> early this morning, and I wanted to hop on and, and, and invite you to set the tone. Set the tone for your week. A lot of people say, you know what? It doesn't matter how you start. It's how you finish. Well, that's partially true. How you start is very important because it can set the tone for how you're going to do things, the enthusiasm you're going to bring, how hard you're going to work, how diligent you're going to be throughout the week. This is the beginning of the week. It's Monday, right? And I believe that it's so important that we set the tone for how the week is going to go. This is the opportunity for us to set the cadence, to, to put the drum beat in place, the rhythm, establish our rhythm for the week. You know, things like being unbothered, things like being confident, things like trusting God, things like smiling and having joy radiating from our spirit. You feel me? Setting the tone. Monday is our opportunity to set our tempo and to get things going in the right direction so that when we hit Tuesday, we're already in a rhythm. When we hit Wednesday, we're in a rhythm. Thursday, you understand what I'm saying. So today, take a minute to set your tone. Decide how you want this work week to go. Make the decision. Listen, don't let the week make the decision for you because it will. If you don't establish how you want this week to go, if you don't have a mindset going into this week, that it's going to be a great week, that it's going to be a wonderful week, a blessed week, something will come along and establish for you what this week is going to be like. So let's start with today. What's Monday going to look like for you? What do you want God to do in this beautiful Monday that you are a part of? Go ahead, pray, seek his face, ask God for what you want this week. No, just today. Go ahead and set that tone. My prayer is not only will you have a great day today, but you'll have a great week as well. This has been Pastor Paul, your pastor and encourager. God bless you, and I'll see you next time.